Yo, what's going on guys? It is a boy Rolls coming at you with another PUBG New State video. And today we're jumping in to talk about the map here for PUBG New State, which is called Troy. Now it's an eight by eight kilometer map, which is currently the only map that's available here for the first alpha for PUBG New State. So again, this is the first alpha. So we don't know, you know, what's gonna change with the game or if they're planning to keep everything the exact same. But for today, I'm gonna go and show you guys the map itself, how they have it. I'm gonna go and talk to you guys about the areas and locations where people drop, as well as talk about two hot drops that I've noticed since I've been playing the game now for about five to six hours. Now, if you guys are new here, make sure to go ahead and click on the subscribe button as well as turn on the notification bell to not miss out on any future videos or streams that we have on the channel. And make sure to go ahead and leave a like for the YouTube algorithm. We'd we'll greatly appreciate it. It helps the channel out a ton and it's free. Let's try to get to 2000 likes in today's vid. So let's go ahead and jump in. Once you guys see the map, you should go ahead and drop a comment down below and let me know if you guys are planning to go ahead and maybe hot drop in those two locations that I mentioned, or if you guys are planning to go ahead and land on the outskirts of the map whenever you guys play the game and play a little bit safer and then rotate to circle maybe mid to late game. So let's go ahead and jump in. I do have some gameplay here. So this is just an entire match that I had, had a pretty intense ending. So hope you guys enjoy. Let's go ahead and talk about Troy. So today we're jumping into the brand new PUBG New State Troy map here called Troy 2051. Now this is gonna be in the future in 2051. So here we have the main locations of the map. So this is the actual map. Now, if we go up north, we have military camp we have trailer park to the right we have laboratory tram factory southeast we have luxury house graveyard city hall these are the main locations to go ahead and drop in and then on the west side we have port police station and in the center we have the exhibition hall and the mall these are the two main locations the the biggest hot jobs i suppose is what you like to call them right so let's go ahead and go to police station here and we'll just jump down main hot drops for this map will be in mall as well as exhibition hall those are the two main places a lot of people are landing there and that's going to be the spot to go ahead and drop at if you guys are looking for a hot drop so PUBG new state only has one map it's not going to have multiple as of right now again this is you know this is the first alpha so this is the very beginning of of the game there's a lot of things that they uh you know can go ahead and fix for example whenever you end the game it'll take you automatically to the lobby. If you guys saw my latest video, you guys saw that, you know, it'll automatically just end the game. It won't even show winner, winner, chicken dinner or that you won and there's a person there. So let's go ahead and actually go this way and see, oh gosh. It looks like someone actually landed with us here. Yeah, so. <laughs> That was actually a, a real person. So I have been practicing a little bit with the, oh, he had a scar and he couldn't kill me. With the sensitivity. So, you know, it is it is a little bit different than what I'm usually uh, used to. So it is gonna take probably maybe one day to go ahead and actually get the sensitivity down. Now I was planning to make a video on the sensitivity, but since it's just the alpha, you don't know what can change, right? They could be changing a lot of things from here to the final version. So I'm gonna go ahead and hold off with the sensitivity, with the settings and stuff like that because it's not the official, you know, release yet. But once it does come out, make sure to go ahead and, you know, and click on the notification bell and also subscribe if you guys are new here because you guys don't wanna miss out on any content that we will be having here on the channel. When the game is released, I, We'll more than likely cover it and it's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a good time. We have a lot of new content here. Go ahead and loot up and then we'll see if we can find some people later on in the game. Probably behind that wall, I think. We're currently over here at police station, so we can go ahead and check out Loganville, Shelton, Graveyard, Midtown. We just got to find a vehicle, that's all. Here we go, we got a U.S. So the U.S. is pointing northwest. Now, I'm not sure about this game in particular, but usually... The vehicles point in the same direction if they respawn. And if they're not a spawn, then they point, you know, anywhere else. But 
Not sure if all vehicles in this game uh, will be pointing northwest, you know? Let's go ahead and actually explore a little bit of the map for you guys. We'll go ahead and check it out. Reminds me a lot of Erangel, to be honest. The hills. The color. So at the moment, we're here at Cornwall. We zoom in. And it's more of like a small town, right? We have a few buildings that are... Kind of... Destroyed, I guess. If we go inside and stuff, these are going to be the type of buildings that we're going to have here in this location. Now, of course, it's going to be very difficult to go ahead and explore the entire map from, you know, from just one video, just because it'll be a long, long video. But this is going to be Cornwall here. Let's go ahead and go to the next location, which will be Loganville. Pretty sure as we do our trips, we will find some people to go ahead and actually fight. I think end games are pretty intense. There's a lot of people left alive in end games, which is uh, which is which is fun. A lot of kills. Now this is a bigger place compared to Cornville. This is going to be Loganville. Looks to me like we only have around three roads, right? And again, a small town. Of course, I don't believe that the buildings will look this way. For the final version i have a feeling that they're going to go ahead and probably tweak the graphics just a little bit but i mean who knows right this is just my opinion but oh look at that we actually have so i'm not sure if this is a spawn but if it is it's pointing north instead of northwest so not all cars point in the same direction that is uh that is confirmed well, let's go ahead and go for that job right there oh it looks to me like we also have a bridge over there too that's interesting Looks like the Golden Gate Bridge from San Francisco. All right, is there anybody here? I don't think so. Go ahead and see what's inside. MKs. I've seen a lot of MKs here. I guess we can take it. How about we go ahead and check out the bridge? I want to go ahead and go to that. And then from there, we can go to Shelton and then Graveyard. We'll go back. But check this out. This is actually a pretty good place to bridge camp. <laughs> Something that this game does really good are the shadows. I talked about it on my latest video when I, you know, I played my very first match. The shadows actually make it look much more realistic. And in my opinion, it's very pleasing to the eye. But some could be, you know against that others might be fans of it like me looks like we have the red zone here so this is going to be the river here let's go ahead and jump in the water and i'll go ahead and show you guys how it looks whenever you are inside so if we dive in let's check this out this looks crazy if they were to add a fish you know that'd be so dope super super realistic one thing, too, that I do have to point out is your character moves much, much, much slower here compared to, you know, other games. It's more realistic, which is something that we, you know, we have to get used to since we are used to playing other games. Can I get up here? Nope. Nope. Oh, yeah. Okay. And it looks like we have another bridge over here, too. But definitely, oh. That must just be like a, an AFK person or someone who's auto running. Oh, I think I hear footsteps too. Under. They have to be under. Our battery is running low too on our vehicle so if you guys remember i did bring up the fact that uh these cars are electric right not all of them but they do have electric vehicles in the game what is this oh this is this is an ev battery <laughs> speak of the so how does this work how does this work do we hop in and what do we do do we use using ev battery 
Will this replace? Oh, look at that. So that actually replaces. That will replace the old battery. It makes sense, right? It's not going to fill it up. That's not the way it works unless you have a charging station. So with this many left, we should probably go center here. It looks like someone's already been here. Got people over there. So whenever you get a headshot too, it actually makes that noise. That really loud ding. 46 remaining still. What in the world? I'm gonna need some ammo. I don't think I'll have any. Oh my god, he's shocking me. That guy almost killed me. I don't know if he missed or what, because he didn't really do a lot of damage. But that, that was insane. With 34 remaining still? I need the ammo. That's the only way I'm going to make it out. Grown cash, too. So I do have to get used to using that. Intense. I have 49 rounds too. that ammo so bad but i think we have we have a full team was over here southwest because he was obviously he was about to kill me that's going to be him right there The last guy over there, right? Well, with that winner, winner, chicken dinner, it finally shows up. So it's actually not glitched like it was last time. So in my last video, it just kicks me out as soon as we won the game. But uh, we're here. Look at that 19 kills, damage we had 2200. Not too bad if you ask me. So that's going to be the new Troy 2051 map. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you're new here, make sure to go ahead and again subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to not miss out on any future videos or streams. And make sure to go ahead and leave a like on the video if you guys want to see some more PUBG New State content. So I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.